What up, folks, and welcome back to my channel. I'm your host, Trillbilly, and this is Trilly B TV. How y'all doing, man? Y'all been good? That's good to hear, man. Always good to hear. But yeah, man, we're gonna get into it. I know previously when I was watching the uh, the American Children compilation, a few of y'all suggested, hey, I should react to some Modern Family. Now, of course, I'm fully aware of the Modern Family series. I'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all. I've only seen maybe, I think, two episodes, man, and they were hilarious. And I do not know why I never went back to watch the entire series. That's actually on my to-do list, man, because I know there's like 11 seasons, but um, yeah, the videos I did watch were just like hilarious, bro. And I'm like, yeah, this is like my top of comedy, man, to the fullest. And you know, the fact that, you know, you have, uh, you know, what you call it, uh, Ted Bundy on there, man. I mean, oh, Al Bundy, my bad, oh, not, 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 not Ted Bundy, no, not that. But yeah, man, well, boy from a, uh, from a, uh, what you call it, Married with Children, so. Man, we're just gonna kick it off uh, with the first season, and this is actually titled Phil Dumfries. Hopefully, that's the last name. Hopefully, I'm not butchering it. Phil Dumfries' Funniest Moments on Modern Family Season 1. And we're gonna get into it, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps your boy out, man. And uh, let's get it. I don't know why I didn't play, but yeah. I'm the cool guy. That's, that's my thing. I'm hip, I, I surf the web, I text, lol, laugh out loud, omg, Whoa. oh my god, wtf, why the face? Uh, bro, what? <laughs> no. Why the face? Why? Okay, yeah. yeah you're the cool dad, that, 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 that's accurate. <laughs> Who is coconuts enough to divorce you? Oh, we gotta <laughs> go, but we'll see you around. Oh. Well, we'll have to have you over sometime. I'd love it. All right. Bye. Bye. She's awesome. No, we are never having her over. Her charity slept with two dads from the school. What? Mm -hmm. That's horrible. <laughs> Bro. Oh, getting everybody out. Oh, he almost hit the key. <laughs> Bro, hold on, man. <laughs> Bro, I'm already like 30 seconds in and I'm left. See, this is my type of comedy. And I don't know. Oh, shame on me that I have not even fully watched the entire series, man. Wow. Also, the morning can be really tough, especially the first day of school. From the minute we get up at 7 until we drop them off at school, it is go, go, go. I get up at 6. <laughs> I get up at 5. Seriously, I get up at 6. That's you? I, th I thought we had a retcon. <laughs> Bruh. This navigation system's all in that stuff. It thinks we're in a park. Oh, my God, it is a park! Away from the kids! Away from the lake! <laughs> And if you oh. pay attention, women will tell you what they want by telling you the opposite of what they want. Like the other day, Claire was like, you have to move your car. There's no space in the garage for both of our cars. And what she's really saying is that, you know, I should probably get a sports car. So, I am so with you. We should blow this out and throw Luke the best birthday party of all. <laughs> yes, yes. We'll order a whole bunch of pizzas yeah. and, and, and set up an arts and crafts table. A what? Yeah, yeah a crafts table. You know, everybody gathers around and they make stuff and then bam they got their own party fever okay. sorry i fell asleep while you were describing the most boring party ever <laughs> ow so what you got there oh these are supplies for the craft table i finally figured out what we're going to be making kids bored <laughs> i'm teasing i'm teasing it looks i am brave roller coasters love them scary movies i've seen ghostbusters like seven times i regularly drive through neighborhoods that have only recently ghostbusters been so yeah i'm pretty much not afraid of anything the firemen in our town have a reputation for being hot. Do I resent that? Of course not. These guys are my friends. I play basketball with them. I bake for them. My question is, what's hot? Hi. No, no, no. I just need a pill. Give me the biggest one you can find. I breathe. Just, just breathe. That's what I told you when you were in labor, and you threw my smoothie at me. Pill! When I find out that my children are looking at a naked picture online, they don't have any privacy. Who is looking at naked pictures? That doesn't matter. I wasn't. Was that me? It's gross. I'm 10. Wait a minute. What's wrong with you people? If it wasn't you, who was it? Manja! No. No, bro. <laughs> Man, come on, dog. <laughs> Can people change? Well, that's a, that is a tough one, but I would say yes, people can change. That's what I believe anyway. And I will till the day I die. You do realize you're proving the exact opposite of your point. See, she's changed. She used to be very supportive of me. The cheerleading in my college was cool. The football players were so jealous they wouldn't even let me and my buddies, Trevor, Scotty, and Ling, go oh, to their parties. 
I've only seen her in 15 years. We used to work together. You worked? Mm-hmm. I can't imagine you working. Lou, let me tell you something. That is very offensive to women. Your mom works very hard. So now she works for us. Oh. Why don't you meet me in the hotel bar and see if you can... Oh, my bad. Hold on, hold on. I, I, I missed that. Careful. You meet let me in the hotel bar. Let me tell you something. That is very offensive to women. Your mom works very hard. So now she works for us. Bro, this dude, hey, I already like no boy, man. He might be one of my favorites so far. Honestly, man, if I was a husband, or if I ever become a husband and family man, this yeah, this is probably how I would act. I'm just gonna keep it 100. Why don't you meet me in the hotel bar and see if you can pick me up there? Careful, lady, you're gonna wake up a sexy, sweet giant. Perhaps I'll be Reginald Appleby. An English gentleman in town for a polo match. Cool. Or honorable businessman from Hong Kong. I'm kind of wrecking it. <laughs> it's not a big deal, Claire. I just train tigers for a living. Dude, no. Stupid man. <laughs> What's Jägermeister? Take it back, I won't do that. Um. Well, you know how in a, a fairy tale, there's always a potion that makes the princess fall asleep and then the guys start kissing her? Well, this is like that, except you don't wake up in a castle. You wake up in a frat house with a bad reputation. That seems about right. Do people want their real estate advice from someone who leads or from someone who follows? I'm betting these babies are coming back in a big way. Buy low, sell high. People are going to see this and say, that guy's high. When was this date? When, when was this area? Because the fact that the porn stash, it's it's like it, it it's it's a thing now. I've seen a lot of dudes rocking the porn stash. I don't even want to call it the porn stash, even though that's exactly what it looks like. Pretty much a mustache from like the nineties, man. Like the mid to like mid early nineties and whatnot, man. You know, a lot of fellas just rock that one little part right here. So wow. Hey man, you was ahead of your time, man. What am I most afraid of? Let's see. Global warming. I'm getting a B. The phone ringing in the middle of the night. But I'm too much of a perfectionist. I mean, this isn't a job interview. Oh, man. Job interviews. <laughs> yeah, everyone gets to see you scared. You want to be that rock that they can grab a hold of in a stormy sea. Actually, a rock would sink, so a floating rock. I'm about to sink. Let's start over. It's Wendy, and you've got a lot of papers. You had a girlfriend before, Mom? Tried to. Trust me, I had plenty of fun in my time. And then I met your mom. And thank you. Why do I always have to come to these things? Because you love your brother. Why don't you make him come to my orchestra concerts? Because we love your brother. What's my coaching philosophy? Man, come on, dude. Give a kid a bird? Yes. And he becomes one of those weird dudes who walks around with a bird on his shoulder. I give him a pair of wings. He can fly. Oh! Unless he has absolutely no hand-eye coordination. Okay, I support you. <laughs> there you go, Al Bundy. Okay. Wait a minute, I want to ask you something. Am I putting you in a bad position with this whole oh, RP, thing? Man. I know he recently Chris passed away. Little put out oh don't worry about it claire didn't like me at first either. funny man <laughs> i can't blame her <laughs> dismissed <laughs> don't you i always felt bad for people with emotionally distant fathers it turns out i'm one of them it's a miracle i didn't end up a stripper thanks daryl i know i got a lot of baggage but don't worry i'm seeing a therapist just kidding i'm fine <laughs> if you show enough houses that you learn all the tricks every realtor is just a ninja and a blazer the average burglar breaks in and leaves clues everywhere, but not me. I'm completely clueless. Quick, do your zombie impression. She hasn't been drinking, has she? Oh, no, no, no. She's, she's hilarious. Okay, let's do Bride of Frankenstein. Oh! <laughs> so, Bruh. So good. Oh, why are you crunching? Ordinarily, I'm a rule follower, but when someone tells me I can't bring my own snacks into their stadium, that's when I get a little... Nuts. It's a free country, right? Wow. Let's just say it ruffles me when some goobers tell me I have to spend half my payday 
on their hot dogs. Okay, here's my idea. I'm really excited about it. The whole thing is <laughs> dressed in white in a single file line down the staircase. Oh, like a line on the highway. No. Uh, or uh, a ski jump. No. Why, why would I want a ski jump? I don't know. My idea was to have the whole family in a giant bed like in Willy Wonka. Yeah, but that's ridiculous. Ridiculicious. I bet it's really cool old magazines. Yeah. Or a bunch of necklaces made out of animal teeth. Or bugs frozen in amber. What if it's really expensive bottles of wine? Or suit of armor. What if there's ancient Indian arrowheads under there? What if it's gold bars? Oh, think? We could get a motorboat. Or a robotic gutter cleaner. Or an indoor pool. Or a two-man submarine. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> That was good. I ain't gonna lie. That was uh, hilarious. Um, like I said, yeah, I remember um a few little uh snippets, man, that I watched. It was man, it was a few years ago, but hilarious show. And like I said, it was, it was like a had like what eleven seasons, so definitely, man, it's a, a cult classic. Uh, buddy, honestly, he, he kind of reminds me of Michael Scott a little bit, man. So the resemblance is definitely there. So that's hilarious. But I would definitely, man, be doing more reactions to Modern Family. And I'm probably just going to start watching the series in general. Because I know I'm way overdue with that. So, but yeah, man. It's your boy, Trimby, man. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And, man, y'all keep giving more suggestions of what y'all want me to react to, man. And I'm out. <laughs>